Pedestal jaw is an important component of a catch nap bogey used in the freight stock. It is responsible for transmitting the tractive as well as the braking effort while in motion. Here we are going to show how to measure the outermost or the long pedestal jaw clearance. First, a marking is being done to find the center point or the midpoint for the jaw. After that, a horizontal line is being made on the surface. Here are the wheel limits allowed in the jaw. Once the horizontal line is being made, chalk is being also applied over there. And by a pointed scribber, the line is being made on the pedestal jaw. Thereafter, with the help of a divider, two arcs are being made on the top of the jaw. This is to find out the center point. Once the center point is being found out, it is being clearly marked on the surface. The chalk provides a better visuality. After the center point has been marked out, a vertical line is being made to give a center point marking which will be later used to match with the gauge. Here is the gauge. The center line marking on the pedestal jaw is now been matched with the gauge center line marking. Once the line marking has been matched, the side clearance can be checked with the help of a go or a no go gauge. In this manner, the side clearance as well as the clearance of the pedestal jaw are being taken in the Indian Railways. It is done in every ROH of the wagon. Thanks for watching.